Hi and welcome back to a quick tutorial in my singles function series. Here we're going to have a look at this annoying one hour offset we have with the SMPTE, the SMPTE code. Uh, if you want to find out what that is, I suggest you Google search SMPTE or SMPTE code. This we have here automatically they've set a one hour offset. So when you've opened up your secondary ruler here, you can see the time ruler up here up the top which gives you the seconds and this can be useful when you're editing uh, audio and you need to edit to seconds and minutes and stuff now i found this really annoying when i started editing uh podcasts that were more than an hour long so what happens is when you get to an hour say so let me just uh come up to an hour here an hour long then marks up two hours so all of a sudden you've got two hours instead of one hour and you, it's, it's just confusing and I found it annoying and uh, slowing down my, my workflow trying to figure out where I was and you know it being one hour and 40 seconds here you know we're right up here and it would be one hour one minute yeah but it says two hours one minute so that's annoying so what you need to do is you go into file project settings then synchronization and what you need to do is enable separate SMPTE or SMPT view offset. So you enable that, there it's gone. Close that, and there you have it. You have the uh, settings now that correspond to what you want. And that is one hour and five, one hour and ten. Yeah, so a lot easier and less annoying. So, anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, like, subscribe, don't forget to hit the notification bell, and I will see you soon. Ciao.